What's going on everybody, Dragas here, and today we're playing some more chicken. Now this game has actually been updated quite a bit since we last played it. It's actually turning into kind of like an adventure survival game, which looks really... Why am I up here? What? What? Can't get you out of my... Okay, but this time the world seems to work for me. So welcome everybody to the new chicken Basically a survival version of the chicken now before we get into this I do want to warn you guys. This is a very early version of this game. It's not even released yet I believe it's released on April 1st So uh, basically the developers gave me access to it because I asked them to and I was really curious to see what they have added since we last played so yeah, we're probably gonna see some bugs, we might see some latency issues, they, they mentioned they want to optimize it some more and whatnot. So just warning you guys ahead of time, this is not the released product, this is a very early version. Anyways, as you can see, we crash landed onto this island and we got a bunch of different loot here, I'm assuming this is kind of like the hub that's giving me enough loot to survive for more than five minutes. Uh, we also got an egg here, break this egg to collect life blocks, okay, so let's slap this thing around and there's a bunch of animal pieces on the ground inside of that egg. I mean, I was under the assumption that eggs made animals, not just made animal pieces, but okay, I guess we'll accept it. Okay, so we got a bunch of animal pieces here. We can also collect tree wood now and other resources. Left click with a branch or rock. Okay, so there we go. Ooh, that's weird. The tree is like actually moving, but it's just the bottom of the tree. Oh my god, there's blocks everywhere. So there we go. There's crafting in this game, by the way, now. I think you can make housing and whatnot. You can also ride your creatures, so creatures aren't just pointless now. And yeah, there's a bunch of other cool stuff too. I'm sure we'll figure it out as we go here. I'm just trying to collect as much as I can, because I gotta assume if they give me all this at the start, I'm going to need it. Hello, little chicken. How are you doing? I don't- God, you are horrifying looking. Am I supposed to do something? Try feeding this creature by throwing some food. Okay, I will throw some food. There you go. Are you gonna eat that? Oh, he does like that. He's hungry. Here you go. Oh my god, it burps now. That's so gross. Before it was just farting, wasn't it? I think now they have burps and farts. Keep feeding. Stay inside of this creature. Soon you will get the petted. Okay, so let's just keep going here. I'm gonna keep feeding you. I have enough food anyway, so start to eat some of this, please. He's not really following my food. Do I gotta put it, like, right in front of you? Are you that lazy? You are that lazy. Okay, wow. I guess I'll just pick these ones up again. <laughs> my god, how many of these are you gonna eat? Like, what is your gut made out of? This creature is now your friend. If you pet it, left click with nothing equipped, craft a whistle or a saddle to control it directly. So we can craft saddles now. All right, let's actually go to the inventory system to see what we can craft. Okay, so here's our crafting menu, and this is our inventory. I believe, because I have- I did play this for a short period of time, and there was a lot more crafting recipes over here, so I believe it only pops up if you have the resources to actually create something. Okay, so we can make these logs. Let's just craft a bunch of them right now. That's a very basic crafting system for right now. I don't know if they're going to be changing that uh, during release, but uh, for right now, I guess we're just going to have to deal with that. We can make a workbench. Let's do that. Can we, can we make an axe yet? No, we need one log and one iron ore, so i got to find iron. So yeah, it's looking like if you have one ingredient, then it will show up and it will just tell you what you need to do it. You can make big squash, like it seems like it's pretty in-depth. Wooden gates, wooden fences, wooden doors. I mean, this looks pretty interesting, honestly. Oh, did he just, did you just lay an egg? Congratulations, buddy, I'm gonna whack this and uh, take some more of your stuff. What the hell? Why, why are you angry? Okay, I, I guess I just did kill its offspring. Let's face it here. I can understand why it'd be angry. <laughs> my, my buddy's attacking him. Oh my God, you killed him. I'm so glad I became your friend because he tried to fuck me up. You are a good friend, my friend. Ooh, what is that? There's something inside of this tree. I don't know if it's like tree sap or whatnot, but as you can see, these trees, uh, they're not very realistic looking right now. Some of them, I mean, <laughs> come on now. Anyways, let's whack this and see if I can get whatever the hell that thing is. I'm curious to see if maybe there's like special items in some trees or whatnot. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna find out. And there we go. So yeah, it did definitely drop whatever the hell that thing is. Uh, we just picked it up here. We also got some new things as well. Uh, we got some sap, so yeah, that's what I was assuming it was, some sort of sap, and it definitely was. We also got a vine. So yeah, that was pretty cool. We also got some fruits here that we can eat and whatnot, and we are getting a little bit hungry, so we do want to eat soon. Actually, let's see how much this can heal me for. Uh, oh yeah, that, that throws it. Whatever, for whatever reason, left mouse click throws it, and right eats it. So, here we go. Yum. It- Oh, it did make it move up a little bit. 
Oh my god, it even sounds horrifying. Alright, is, is this iron right here? Can I try and mine this, maybe? I'm, I'm going to get ore with a freaking stick. You watch. There we go. Did it. Told you. And that should be, hopefully, maybe, just maybe... Oh, it's just stone. Shit. Okay, one of these rocks has to be iron. I'm going to just mine them all, because I'm going to need it regardless. This kind of looks like a piece of poop. I'm hoping it's not. Oh, there we go. We got some more poops, and uh, yeah, we should be good here. There's got to be some... Some of these have to be iron. Okay, so we did get three iron. We also got some limestone and some ordinary stone. Now, unfortunately, I need an iron ore to create this axe, so we also got to build a furnace, which takes six stones. So we should have actually enough stone here, which is perfect. Okay, as you can see, it is pretty much nighttime here now, and what I'm going to do throughout the night is just gather, gather, and more gathering. I do want to hopefully build a house in this episode, try out, and maybe build a creature as well, uh, just so we can get a good baseline of what this game is all about. So yeah, I won't bore you with the punching of trees, but hopefully by daytime we should have enough wood and whatnot to create a nice little house for ourselves. What the f- There's so many noises right now, I can't see anything. There's fucking cats meowing over here. I don't know what this thing is, but it is horrifying looking. I gotta get the hell out of here. Is that a- Is that a cat with a light on his face? Oh my god! That is so cute and cool! Don't, don't attack me! Oh! Oh! Oh, this creature is trying to eat you! No, I don't wanna- You should not be eating me right now! Here, man, have an apple! Jesus Christ, don't- Please don't eat me! There you go! And you know what? I would really love to tame you, because you look freaking badass! And if you're aggressive enough to attack me, then I want you on my side! Okay, we only got seven food left. This thing likes to eat a lot of food, obviously. Do, do you like these things? Please tell me you like these things. Okay, good. He's gonna eat that one, keep feeding. Come on! Please let me tame you, because I need some of this food as well. Okay, seriously? Seriously? Almost there? Am I gonna be there yet? I, I only have two left. This creature is your friend! You can pet it! And we have enough to eat one as well, which is perfect, because I need some health as well as some food. So now we can pet this lion-looking crazy bastard, and he's gonna hopefully support me as well. And it is daytime, so let's just test this thing out. Come here, lion. Are you gonna come towards me? I kinda wanna kill this cat, because I wanna gather the things on him. Oh my god, are you- <laughs> I didn't realize it was attacking me, are you serious? Oh, uh, player has died. Well, that was a complete failure, now wasn't it? I spent all fucking night freaking scavenging only for me to die to a cat with a light bulb on his head. Are you still my friend? This creature is my friend. Okay, good. At least I have you as a friend. And that means I have that lion as a friend, so not all is lost, my friends. I think... Is that my lion, bro? I think I found where I died. Now, the question is, is there loot on the ground anywhere here? As you can see, it does lag when I do move around. Just a warning. Uh, is this my friend? Are you my friend? Oh no, no, you're not my friend! Oh shit! Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, do you die quick to these aggressive motherfuckers. Okay, well I'm gonna say I pretty much lost everything, so I am just going to start gathering some more of this food. And I'm just gonna suck it up and uh, start from the beginning again. Okay, I am back once again, and I did a full day of gathering. It is finally morning again, and I got quite a bit of resources, as you can see. So now we're going to get into the actual crafting of this. First of all, I'm obviously going to want a furnace, because we are going to need that. I also probably... Well, I don't know if I want stone walls or just wood walls. So I'm going to convert a lot of this wood into logs here. I don't know how much I need right now, but uh, I do have a lot of wood. So there we go. We got 35. That should give us access to a lot of wooden things. Uh, which you can see, in fact, down here. Now, we do need a workbench for all of this as well, so I forgot to make another one of those. Let's grab one of these guys, and I guess we can just put these things on the ground and uh, start building some other things. I was hoping to put them in a house, but I can't build the house without the workbench, unfortunately. So, let's grab this, and grab this, and start actually crafting some real things. Okay, so here's my little furnace. Let's just put it uh, right at the beach here. That's a that's a nice little view as we are crafting. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was I I pressed Q to see if I could rotate it, and it actually drops it. So I don't know how you're supposed to rotate these. For right now, though, I don't think we need that. Let's just put this right here, like so. So yeah, placement could be a bit better in this game. You can see my workbench is floating in the sky here, but uh, I'm not gonna complain too much. Let's get some iron ore in here uh, before I forget. Okay, so for whatever reason, when I press E to use furnace, I don't know if I'm doing this wrong. None. Why does it say none? Okay, 
I don't want to use the workbench. I should not have put these so close together because they are kind of a pain in the ass to use. But yes, when I try and use the furnace, as you saw there, there's no iron ore popping up. So I don't know really what I'm doing wrong. Maybe I need like coal or something, but even if I usually have one resource, it shows up in here that I can actually craft it. I'm not seeing iron ore anywhere in here. So that just means I can't actually craft my axe right now, which isn't too big of a deal. I'm actually more curious about this workbench anyways. If I can get to actually using it, there we go. Oh wait, so when I use the workbench, I can craft an axe. So I don't know, what is the furnace for? Is it just for cooking? Now that is confusing. The actual furnace is only for food products. I thought it was for metals as well. Uh, clearly it's been a while since I played a game like this. Anyways, now that we have that figured out, uh, at least we can start building some stuff here. I'm going to want some wooden walls. I think I'm going to make a wood house for right now. I'm not feeling like I need a stone house. Okay, so we made four wood walls here. I think that's all I can afford. We also can make some maybe some wooden fences. Stucco roof, we might want to do that as well. Let's just get the, the basics for right now. Stone door, that looks pretty cool actually. I'm going to get one of those. Uh, do we have any windows or anything in here? Okay, so there is windows in here, but I need three silica ores. I don't even know where those come from, so I'm not going to worry about that right now. Ooh, a whistle. That actually is something I really want, because we can tame some pets and tell them to follow me then. I wish I knew how to make the actual saddle, though. Uh, we also got a slingshot here. We want that. Uh, what else is there in here that looks interesting? Small rock. I'm sorry, but that is the weirdest looking rock that I have ever seen. Okay, so I started making my little house here. This is going to be a wood-stone-house hybrid. Uh, that looks good. I actually don't know how to rotate these. I think it's just, like, snap in place. Yeah, so that's not too bad. Uh, I think this is pretty much all I can do, though, for right now. But the good thing is I got that axe, so I can uh, hopefully chop down some trees much quicker. Let's go find out. Okay, axe, let's see how good you are. Two hits? Are you serious? That is so much quicker. Okay, I'm really glad I made that axe because getting wood logs is not going to take long now. Is that... Did you guys kill your friend? Like, seriously? Seriously, guys? Are, are you that aggressive towards each other? I mean, I appreciate the life blocks, but seriously? God damn, I have some aggressive neighbors. And by the way, I decided to actually build here because these things actually reset with new food every now and then. So basically, I have endless food right at my front door. Mind you, you can make a farming plot regardless, so I could have just made one wherever I want, but I like this place anyways. It feels nice here, it feels safe, all I got is chickens to deal with. I mean, they are pretty aggressive, they just killed their fucking brother, but that's just something I'm gonna have to deal with. Alright, but we got a bunch more wood now, so we should be okay to, uh, hopefully finish up this house. Okay, so there we go, we're just going to finish this up, make a nice little square house here. Let's actually get inside so we don't get locked out. There we go, that's beautiful. Now I can do wooden floors as well, and I hopefully I should have... Ooh, these things go way too high. Okay, so we're not gonna have floors in this house. This one's just gonna be a nice sandy floor. And I waited till daytime only because I just wanted you guys to be able to see. Um, I'm actually trying to figure out an easy way to put on a roof. There's not... Oh, what the... No, what the hell did I just do? Well, I guess I made an easy way to put on my roof now. I guess hitting control, by the way, if you are playing this game or planning on playing it, places things. Now I know, and for whatever reason, there's an invincible wall on these things. So yeah, I'm gonna say my first complaint is definitely the crafting system in this game. There we go. I actually was able to get up. Now, can I put this exactly where I want it? Not really. There's no freaking easy way to do this. I'm assuming I gotta put like a floor down, and then I can easily place this on the roof. So we're not even gonna have a roof right now. This is our little house. Very simple. I just wanted to show you guys the whole crafting system in this game. Uh, needs a lot of work, but really what this game shines in is its actual character creation. Or I guess technically it would be creature creation, because you can't really create your actual character. So yeah, I'm gonna go out and try and scavenge maybe some, um, some character pieces. Uh, looks like, is there, what the, these guys just keep dying. Did, did they, like, seriously eat each other? Is there anyone left? We got some more pieces over here. No, I think they seriously died. Oh, there's there, there, there's one final one. The hell did you do your, to your brothers? You know what? I should probably make you my friend because you are clearly the strongest chicken around. And I want you on my team. Are you going to eat these? Come on. Do I have to put them? I have to put them right in front of his beak. Like, even if it's just beside him. He's not, he's not cool with that. Okay, he's almost there, it says. Oh, my God. Seriously, just... They're right behind you. You can literally see me throwing them. Why are you that picky? This creature is my friend. Perfect. 
Okay, let's try out this little whistle thing. I think that what this does is make them just follow you, so here we go. That was nice. It's not- he's not even fucking listening. Does he have ears? Maybe he just can't hear me, I don't know. <laughs> what the hell, man? Please come over here. Hello? Oh, oh shit, I slapped it! I, I didn't mean to slap it, I meant to pet you! Oh no, please be my friend, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I don't- I don't want to piss you off, here. No, just- just eat, just eat. Okay, he, he's- he's angry. Are you cool now, man? Did, did you calm down? I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to do that, here. There, 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 there you go. Okay, he's, he's back to normal. This creature is my friend. I'm sorry for slapping you, man. I didn't mean to do that. Let me do this again. There we go. I just wanted to pet you. That's all. I'm just petting you. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't know if he likes it. He, he, just, he just looks angry. That's the problem. I mean, to be fair, I would be pretty fucking angry if I had one leg, two to walk around on. That would just be annoying. Okay, but as you can see, my whistle is working freaking great. I don't know if it's just because these guys don't have ears or what. Okay, so what I'm gonna do today is try and look for some more eggs or creatures that I want to kill for their actual pieces. Like, this guy over here looks pretty damn cool, but he also looks pretty damn dangerous, so I'm gonna let him go. I'm gonna go back to the light bulb cats if I can, in fact, find them. Because I'm thinking, especially with how dark the nighttime is in this game, having something with a light bulb is going to be extremely useful if I can get it to follow me. Okay, I heard one cat. There's a bunch of different creatures over here. Ah, uh, yes, there we go, we have Mr. Lightbulb Cat. Now the question is, do I just make him my friend, or do I kill him for his parts and remake him? Because I kind of like him just how he is. I don't know if I trust all these other things around though. I mean, look at him, he looks badass. Okay, let's just try and at least lure him away from everybody. Come here, kitty. Kitty, kitty, pay, pay attention, little kitty. There, there, there you go, yummy, come here, yes, this way. Come on, see the little ball, it's right in front of you. Oh, it just farted. Oh, yes, the bait is working. Come here, buddy. Come on. Yeah, look at him. Look at those eyes. He hasn't eaten in a while. Can, can you get down to that one? You having a little bit of a hard time? You can't eat it? Here, I'm gonna... Oh, shit. Don't, don't, don't be pissed off. I'm just trying to help you out. Here, try, try that one. Is this one better? There you go. Okay, man, I'm almost out of food. This creature is your friend. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Now, come here. Now, the problem is I gotta figure out how to get it home. So, can you listen to the whistle? Oh! Oh, you can! That one works! Oh god, I don't know if it's attacking me or what. Okay, so yeah, this creature is just following me now because of my whistle. So the other creature that I attacked, or not not, not attacked, became my friend, must have not ha have had ears or something. Come here. This way. There we go. Oh my god, that's so cool. Okay, little kitty, welcome to your new home. I should probably actually make like a fence for him or something, because he's not going to hang around here. The fuck was that? This this cat's making weird ass noises. It's tripping me out. Okay, so I made some wooden fences here. I don't actually know. I mean, it's showing as a fence, but all I see is a post. So I wonder if I put it down here, and then if I go, is this, is this seriously just posts? Like what the hell? Oh, okay. So yeah, they do attach together. That's really weird. Now, if this one goes lower because I can't get it to go higher because the ground is going lower, does it still? No, it doesn't fucking work. What the hell is this shit? All right, you know what? There we go. That's this is so weird. This is going to be the most ghetto fenced in place ever, but you know what? I think it's going to work regardless. There we go. As as long as they're safe in here, that's all that matters, I guess. The fuck, cat? Leave me alone! I don't want to pet you right now! God damn it! This cat- It's just like my real-life cats. It just won't leave me alone. Okay, cat, seriously? I'm trying to fucking craft! Did you just- What the- Are you eating me? What the- It just picked me up! What the fuck is wrong with you? God damn it, I'm trying to make you a home right now, cat. Okay, well, for whatever reason, when the cat decided to attack me, it actually broke my crafting system. I'm pressing E right now, and it's not letting me use the workbench. I can't... I mean, I can get into my inventory, but I still can't get into my crafting workbench. So, I guess I can't make a fence right now. Cat! What are you doing right now? So, for right now, we're just not gonna have anything over here or over here, because I ran out of fences. So, come here, cat. Are you going to actually listen to me? There we go. Okay, so it's coming in. Let me actually open this up before it seriously attacks me. I can't use anything. Okay, there we go. So yeah, it's a little buggy. Come on, get in here. You, you can do it. There we go. And you you know what? You're staying in there because you, you've been bad. You tried to eat me. Oh god, it's attacking me again. 
And that's all that really matters is the fact that it can't get out and I can, so that's actually perfect. Okay, but we're gonna use all these creature parts that I have collected to actually make our own creature as well. Now, the only thing I've really collected is the chickens over there that decided to uh, kill each other. Um, but we're gonna look for some more later on. For right now, though, I do want to make a little chicken. So if you don't remember what chicken is, this is really the base of the game. This is really what sold the game as something unique. You can actually create your own animals with anything that you find throughout the world. So for right now, we only have chicken things, but we can actually create a cute little chicken animal. So I'm going to try and create some sort of elongated chicken thing, hopefully with muscly arms. Well, I don't really have any arms right now, so we'll have to add that later, because you can actually refine these as you go. But something like that... And we're just going to put some legs right on the back here. And, uh, yeah, some eyes and we should be good to go. Okay, we're just going to put some little chicken legs on you. This guy's going to be pretty damn basic. There we go. Nice little chicken legs. Uh, obviously, do we not have any beaks? Did I? Oh, okay. I just forgot to bring him over. I was like, I hope he can have a mouth. Okay, there we go. Oh, look at it. It's looking around. That looks great. Uh, do I want these things? I kind of want them on the side like that. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, man, this is a gross-looking creature. And then, of course, every chicken needs some uh, very useful wings. So there we go. You know what? Let's put let's put us two sets of wings on this sucker. I mean, he's got a big enough body. That looks freaking awesome. And we got two chicken combs as well, so we may as well do two of those. There we go. A little one there and a little one there. That's really all I can do right now. Oh, wait. We got peacock feathers. Uh, we're going to put these suckers... I don't even know, like, I think that, that looks kind of cool when it's going down its back, so maybe we can do that, and do that maybe again, there we go, it's hiding its, um, chicken cone now, but it's just gonna have to deal with that, and you know what, let's put some, like, that, oh yeah, that's gonna look really scary, there we go, and finally, let's just put one on the butt, also on his butt, just because for defensive reasons, yes, point that butt at me, we're gonna put a little beak there, there. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Okay, so I think it's gonna try and walk both ways now because it thinks it has two heads, but I'm curious to see how this thing works, so come on chicken! Come to life! There we go! Hello friend, how are you? Oh, oh, okay, are, are you... are you trying to eat me? Oh, what, what, what are you doing to me? <laughs> okay, I think this guy just really likes me. Actually, does he need to be fed? I don't even know. Here, do you want that? Oh, he does. Okay, so there you go! Okay, guys, we're gonna end this episode of Chicken here. I hope you enjoyed uh, this little quick look at the new adventure mode in Chicken. Gotta be honest, uh, I think it needs a lot of work, but I think it's got great potential as well. I really like the added fact that you can create your own creatures. And the survival aspect, although very basic right now, isn't too bad at all. But let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this game. Do you think it'd be a cool little series on the channel? I don't think I'm going to uh, do too much more yet, only because it's so early into the development. When the game's actually released, I think I'll get back on it and see what else they have. But they're supposed to have like things like dragons and whatnot right now, so I'd like to kind of find those as well. So maybe I'll do another episode as well. I don't know, it just depends on what you guys think of this. So yeah, thanks for all your support, guys. Thanks for watching and liking, and I will see you in the next one.